Meanwhile, a Florida man recovering after he was attacked by a bear during a hunting trip in Wyoming. His friend, who was also the tour guide, was killed in the attack. Hadas Brown spoke with Corey Shuban about the tragic incident. When that bear did have me by the back of the leg, thinking to myself that this is it, this is, this is my death, and this is how I'm dying. Two new friends on a hunting trip. Only one made it back alive. Mark Uptain was Corey Chuban's guide on the trip in Wyoming. They caught an elk Thursday evening and went back Friday to pack it up. We heard rocks tumble and all of a sudden we turn around and we see two giant grizzly bears full charge coming right at us. The first bear went for Uptain, clawing him. As Chuban tried to load their pistol, the second bear attacked him. He swiped at me on my arm and then he went around behind me and grabbed my back of my ankle and he swung me by his jaws. I tried to throw the gun to Mark. It didn't make it to him and the gun landed on the ground and the, somehow the grizzly let me go and charged Mark again and that's when I made the decision to just run for my life. Rescuers airlifted Shuban to the hospital in Wyoming. Now he's back in New Smyrna Beach, still visibly wounded, but able to walk. Emotionally, he's got a long recovery ahead. And the approach that he took in dealing with the bears probably saved my life. As Shuban continues to recover here in New Smyrna Beach, he tells me that Mark Uptain leaves behind a wife and five children. Reporting in Volusia County, Hadass Brown, WESH 2 News.